As a young child, uh, I wanted to be a writer. It uh, struck me as being a very glamorous and easy and pleasant life. Little did I know. As a child, I was very much afraid of the dark and afraid to be alone. My first thought was, man, this guy's got to be heat. William would make a great prisoner. You know, I mean, in solitary. Is like never sees anybody, never goes out, hates parties. But my lawyer walks in. He said, "Don't say anything, Bill. Don't say anything." Well, Kerouac said that Burroughs was the most intelligent man in America. I probably repeated that a million times. I started to write in Mexico in 1948. He could punch a typewriter, or he could punch a tape recorder to death. Shorter time than any man that I've ever known. <laughs> He's probably the only guy I know who is really just full-out junkie. Time out. I, I just happened to get that number with you on the cover. I think he's gone, Doctor. Well, it's all a day's work. This Dick. I'm very pleased tonight to introduce a man who, in my opinion, is the greatest living writer in America. Here is Mr. William Burroughs. <laughs>